Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the Node.js. Today we are going to learn how to resize the images before uploading to the S3 bucket with the help of Malta. So let's have a look how we are going to do that before. Those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. So let's get started. So here you can see that we have to install the package that's name is Malta Sharp S3. And the rest of the things we have already discussed in the previous video, right? So express dot env multa multa s3 and the multa shop s3. Okay. Any issue regarding the multa s3, you will also get this in my video. Also, I already uploaded if the multa is not multa s3 is not working. Okay. So after that, we have to configure the AWS SDK update authentication part, right? And this is the main part that we have to do that is called the storage s3 storage we have to take right bucket key acl and the resize so on which format you want to resize height and the width you can just add it over here right and then upload multiple storage storage and upload here you can upload multiple single anytime or you can change it accordingly right so i'm going to upload the single image okay so let's try to upload this one image so here we have this one so let me upload the image. So I'm going to upload this image. So you can say, see that the image height and width, right? Send this image, okay? And this is successfully uploaded. Done. This is the image path, okay? So I'm going to copy this image path, copy link, and try to check this one. Okay, so here we go with this one. So you can see that the image resize, okay? So this is the width that is 400. I want to make the width like smaller. Okay. So let's make it like uh, 300 or 200 or 100. Okay. Save this. Restart. Okay. So let's try to upload again the image same. So I'm going to take the image again and upload this one. Upload it. Let's have a URL of that one. Copy link. And check it's 100 or not you can see that the image is resize okay so you can resize this image according you what the parameter you want to add whether you want to resize with height and the width the same so you can put it over here like this okay so this is how we are able to resize the images via multi shop s3 any doubt any query in that let me know in the comment section in the next video we are going to learn how to compress the images. Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great day.